Hey, I was just looking over a question called, My ex's best friend is hot. Okay, so the thumbs up's not in there, but there's totally an exclamation point, so we're going to go with that, okay? It was sent in by Mr. Nice Guy, and it reads, Okay, so I've really liked my ex's best friend for years now, but I felt like I've never had a shot at being with her. That is, until now. Her boyfriend has been treating her really badly, and I think she might appreciate someone making her feel good. What would be a good way to try and show her that I'm interested in her in that way without coming off as just wanting a piece of ass? <sighs> Mr. Nice Guy, you fell for your ex's best friend? Really? You know that's sticky territory, no matter what the case may be, because your ex is always going to be somehow involved. But whatever the case may be, she's a woman, you're a guy, it's totally legit that you want to start a relationship with her. And the fact that she's got a bad boyfriend right now could be your perfect opportunity. How are you going to go about doing this? Well, you're probably going to have to stick with being a nice guy for a little bit longer than you want to, but it's going to be well worth it. You've got to be her friend. You've seen that movie Just Friends where he's always her little confidant in the middle of a sticky situation. Well, that's what you've got to be for her. You've got to be her support system, her backup, so that whenever her boyfriend beats her or calls her bad names, I don't know what the situation is, but whenever he treats her badly, you can be the one that she calls up and says, Man, this is what happened. I'm so upset. I don't like this anymore. And then you can slowly build up a reputation of trust, of care, and you're going to be the one that she turns to whenever she needs something done. And once you develop that kind of standard, eventually you can work that into a relationship. Obviously, you're going to have to wait for her to break up with a bad boyfriend, and that's probably just a matter of time. But as long as you're there to be her little shoulder to cry on in any situation, you can at least get yourself ready for that relationship stage. So when she finally comes to her senses, she's going to be like, wow, look at Mr. Nice Guy. He's been there all this time, and he's absolutely amazing. He's the one that I want to be with. Don't automatically date her right after she breaks up. In fact, don't even bring it up for the next probably month or so while she's on the rebound, because then you will look like you're coming across as wanting a piece of ass, and obviously you don't want to do that. If you give it a little bit of time, though, you can get that ass, but it's just a matter of patience. So as long as you can maintain that patience, work in your little subtle charm every once in a while, you should be good to go. Good luck.